Shruman Gill came into this tournament with a lot of expectations because he was doing so well, which is why he's up there on our Nokri career score. Uh, Simon and Joyda, as you all know, uh, Crick Buzz along with Nokri.com have come up with something called a Nokri career score, um, in which Nokri uses his expertise to uh, help uh, cricket uh, grow careers and applies this to cricket stats. And what we see is uh, a whole new way of looking at cricket stats, which is why uh, Shubman is top on that list because he's been doing so well. Uh, Simon, you know, you've known him since his under 19 days. You'd sent Harsha a message as well. So you'd spotted him very early. And uh, are you are you he's, happy he's, with the graph? Look, he's the best. He's the best headhunter ever. <laughs> <laughs> In 2018, he was telling, this is the man. The, this is the, give him a promotion man. immediately. Mm. Yeah, well, look, it was just, I was just watching that World Cup in New Zealand. And, and you know, there's a lot of talk around Prithvi Shaw and, and, and I'd sort of gone on to the game with the preconceived <coughs> idea that he was going to be the star of this Indian side when you turn up. Uh, and I, I sat there and I watched Shubman bat and I just thought, wow. And after watching Prithvi bat as well and get out and, and just that back foot that he's never fixed. Mm. He's never fixed that back foot movement that, that moves away to leg stump. And Shubman Gill just looked the class above. And I messaged Harsha and I said, because all the talk was about Prithvi Shaw, and I said, this kid Gill will be a far better player than Prithvi Shaw and he will have so much more success. And it was just like one of those, I don't know, it was like a throwaway comment, but you, you, I didn't discover him by any stretch of the imagination, but he is, look, he's just such a good player to watch. I mean, he's he's got all the attributes of a quality, all format player. Um, just the fact that he times the ball so beautifully, he plays a short pitch bowling well, um, and he's had an incredible year. And I mean, you know, he, he sits on the on the top of that Norkri standings. He's, I know a couple of guys are chasing him down. A couple of his teammates are chasing him down. But he's he's also had what two or three games off with with the dengue. Um, you think about his year so far: the double hundred against New Zealand, five other hundreds that he's scored uh, in ODI cricket. And he just he just strikes that sort of. He's got an air of confidence about him, which I really like. Yes. You know, don't confuse confidence with arrogance because he's not arrogant by any stretch. He's just a lovely young man. And um, there's a lot to like about him. He's, just, he's got a massive future. He's got a huge future as far as I'm concerned. You know, Joyda, on that Nokri career score, you see him up there. There's Rohit and Virat, but he's also up there. So there's something very, very special yeah. about Shubman, which is why he kind of tick marks and he's in the top 10 in all these four, be it the longevity, well, exactly. situational performance, win contribution and consistency. I think that's, that's the important thing for you, you know, uh, situational performance. One is longevity. He's been around, he's played most of the games and even when he went out, Dengi is something that knock, normally knocks you off. But he was back just after two games. So longevity is there. Consistency, three formats, century in three formats this year. That is an unbelievable this thing. To, in a year to have a T20 century, test centuries, five ODI hundreds is unbelievable. Win contribution, of course, there is an advantage. He's batting up front. You know, it always gives you an advantage. And situational awareness, again, you know, big chases. He has that ability to adjust and what one of the reasons why he and Rohit are working so well mm. is the fact that he adjusts his motor according to the gear Rohit is going at and they manage to motor well, very well together. And I'll say the one reason that put him up on top, even above all those, if I had to look at him, is upside. Mm. So, you know, Rohit and Virat are there in their careers. I mean, they are now at the maybe early evening, but in the evening of their <laughs> careers, you know. Yeah. But he is right now in the morning, he's in the glorious morning, the sun has just risen on him and he's going to dominate Indian cricket and world cricket for a long, long time. Well, as they call him now, the Prince, so let's hope that Prince Gill kind of consolidates Nokri career score. So we have one more tick uh, in those boxes where India is ticking everything, right?